Both the Fortuner and its predecessor, the Hilux Ute, were equipped with a mild hybrid turbo diesel powertrain, resulting in a notable enhancement for both cars. The new approach aims to decrease fuel use by up to 5% by utilizing a 48-volt battery and an electric motor generator. The potential implementation of this function in Australia remains uncertain. Nonetheless, it was originally introduced in South Africa. The Fortuner 48V, specifically designed for South Africa, includes a 2.8-liter four-cylinder turbo-diesel engine along with a mild hybrid powertrain. The vehicle is equipped with components that deliver 150 kilowatts of power and 500 nanometers of torque. Both the Land Cruiser Prado 250 Series and the Toyota Hilux V-Active, which are set to be launched in Australia, will adhere to the same plan. The Toyota Fortuner is a hybrid vehicle with a mild hybrid system. It is equipped with a six-speed automatic transmission and has a configuration that uses four-wheel drive on a part-time basis. Regrettably, the eight-speed automatic gearbox, which is offered on the new Prado, is not included. This gearbox incorporates a higher quantity of gears, potentially leading to enhanced fuel efficiency. Despite the greater technology, the cost of the light hybrid system in the Fortuner is higher compared to previous generations. The Hilux V-Active is available for purchase in Australia at a price range of $590 to $770. This amount is an extra $900, which is equal to 11,000 Rand in South Africa. Both the Fortuner and the Hilux are imported from Thailand to Australia. However, Australia currently lacks a sufficiently developed electric grid to support both vehicles. Consequently, I am pondering whether this fuel-efficient technology will be included in the predictions for buyers in Australia. In 2015, the product was initially made available for purchase in Australia. Subsequently, in 2020, it underwent a midlife makeover and incorporated new technology. However, the form of this variation differs from the one utilized in South Africa. The number of Toyota Fortuners sold in Australia in the previous year was just 3,619, which is significantly lower compared to the Ford Everest and Prado models that were replacing them at that time. Anticipation is high among Australians ranging from Toyota enthusiasts to potential car buyers, as they eagerly anticipate the announcement of the release date for the mild hybrid Fortuner. We will provide you with regular updates on any fresh facts we uncover regarding this captivating SUV phenomenon.